but that was quite a, a strong pull, you know, to change, well, to come here. Yes, I knew immediately that when the four days was happening over the East, I, I was going to come. And I realized that the four days so much, I need longer. And I, I even, I think, um, because I've realized that coming here, the depth you can go is, is complete. Um, you can go all the way if that's what, you know, you're ready to do. So with that knowing, I think coming for a short amount of time, I didn't feel safe enough because it's going to, you know, can imagine. So, um, I think Ananta is such a special being and there's, it's like it can trust and that's not easy. I'm, I'm realizing, you know, just to trust because there's always a limitation with humans and, um, and I've done so many different types of things, you know, I've tried everything, I think. And, and then I just took myself away from it to just be with me. And then I, um, I think I kind of got quite sick for a year where I was forced to do nothing and just sit on the couch. So that was like coming to myself. And then maybe that's why I'm ready now for this to be met by another person to then to go into that place where I can really like see myself. So just to know that, yeah, this is um, <laughs> this is a, a place that you can trust and understand how truth and love are the same, um, and that you already are that. And this is somewhere we can also see that in everybody in the whole group. And I'm my thing was always disappearing and leaving the room, and um, yeah, there wasn't a chance of that with Ananta. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing how she can just see everything, everyone, feel them without even her eyes. So I would just, for a minute, my thought start to go in a story and immediately. And that's such a gift because then yeah. what that means is that, okay, I'm actually going to be in life now, not inside of mm. my head doing something away from life. Yeah. So I know that um, there's so much more to be done, but that actually that what that feels like is it just fills my heart up. And everything and makes this part alive so it, yeah it's very good <laughs> thank you hello beautiful all the way from germany that's quite a trip to come and um how has this uh, these four days um, moved you mm. Mm. it's been really challenging and um that's wonderful um the intensity that is here and also the intimacy because it's not a big crowd but it's uh, you can meet all the people eye to eye literally and um, the difference I feel now is um, I think at home I felt like truth uh, or my true being it, it was come to a concept and I couldn't I didn't remember what it meant and now I, I've come back to to, re, to remembrance, what it really feels like, and uh, I'm dedicated much more. Oh, thank you. Hello, lovely. You've come also from Germany. Um, quite a trip, no? Mm -hmm. And what really was the pull to move all the way from Germany to come to the south of England to be with Ananta? Um, I've. I've met Ananta for the first time in Thailand and um, it just moved so much that I felt like I um, I was I was looking for this true meeting again and um, it's just so rare to to find this anywhere else or yeah in in the real world <laughs> and so uh, when you come back here it's just um oh, I've, it's so difficult to put it in words <laughs> it's just um ananta's creating the just the space to let this happen that everybody can meet, truly meet, and come home.
and that's how it feels to me just to come home mm. yeah and uh, <laughs> I'm yeah I'm just so happy that I came and that I was able to met meet all of you so <laughs> thank you hi Kirsty hello it's been quite a journey for you hasn't it is there, how could you uh, share with us this uh, four days with Ananta mm. yeah it feels like it's been a real journey and I feel like before I arrived here I was carrying so much emotional baggage and stuff with me I felt really disconnected and confused in this in this state and um, mm. now I'm, I'm feeling like I'm reconnected with this with myself with my true self and I'm, I feel like I'm seeing from a, a new place which I feel I've experienced before and somehow I since being back in London and in the kind of normal world I, I lose a sense of my of myself and I feel reconnected <clears throat> thank you and you're shining mm. you know, very clear mm. radiance from you <sighs> thank you thank you <laughs> mm. <laughs> Could you tell us a, a little bit about your experience during this four days retreat with an unpack? Mm -hmm. um, there's too much I want to say that has no words, um, but I've absolutely loved every minute of it. I really find an answer's easy going. Um, not taking everything taking things lightly is really refreshing and helps you me feel relaxed and i'm going away feeling i have a lot of clarity on why i'm here and yeah i feel full mm. Mm. and what is it that you would say to someone who had never heard of ananta Quenchi before what would you like what would be your sharing mm. with them? That she's amazingly down to earth and real. And I just think that that's so, so important in this time with all of the different things that there are available. The down to earth and realness and the, that you can relate. And also her amazing heart. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Um, I don't need a question necessarily. <laughs> no, just looking at your work and see the transformation, you know, over the few times that you've come and mm. over the four weeks. And is there anything you would like to share? Hmm. Yeah. Um, I'm very glad I came for this retreat, and I had a real wanting to, not wanting to struggle, and is this the right thing? And Am I just going because it's near where I live? Do I really want it? And anyway, finally, I went and I, as soon as I was here, I was very glad. And um, it's a real um, nice small space. There's not too many people in a real cooking pot to trigger while you're sitting there, trigger all your little spots. And, and I'm, I'm, glad, I'm glad for that. And that's sort of comfortable and then relaxing and uncomfortable. And and the thing is with Ananta, it feels like she doesn't let you get away. And at the same time, it's really welcoming. And it's really getting you where you need to be met. And there's a real big dedication to that. And so, you know, whatever resistance is just then be felt as it's just mine. And it can, you know, the time obviously helps to have four days. I was only doing three, but, you know, to have a prolonged time obviously helps. So, yeah, mm -hmm. recommended. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, um, Chris, we've been seeing you for nearly two years, you know, on and off. 
mm-hmm. all the way from Liverpool. So mm-hmm. there must be quite a strong pull to travel all this way from the north of England to come to the south to meet Ananta Kranji. Yeah. Um, yeah, I just know I have to come. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, I just feel such a richness here. And just... Uh, yeah, I just know I have to, have to come, want to come. Um, and it seems to be working. <laughs> uh, how, was, how is it touching you to come here? Um, I can just feel a greater depth when I'm here. And yeah, I've been trying, my mind's been trying to figure it all out and I'm kind of just getting a sense that it's, there's nothing to get and that it's just, yeah, just a feeling of kind of love and peace is arising while I'm here. And yeah, I've got a lot of hope. Thank you. Is there anything you would like to say, Um, Barbara, from this um, four days intensive, which is not your first one, but you know, it's. uh... Uh, Yes, I at the moment I just feel moved. It's just happening now. I'm. I feel moved by that what I have not known a name and it is reality this love it's this oneness I think it's the first time actually I experience really experience that I'm not separate I've heard this many times yes and read of course also many times (laughs) Hello, Kat. <laughs> uh, yeah, this has nourished me so deeply and filled with joy. I, actually, I don't know what to say. I'm really moved. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> Oh, hi. Hello. What, what do you think has touched you the most? Um, how has um, meeting Ananta transformed you? Because we've been seeing you for quite a, quite a while now. Yeah, I've been a few times. I think this is my um, fourth time here. And um, it's just been amazing in the how to live this truth and honesty and love in in life so it's you know all about the the everyday life how to incorporate it into that as well as you know these wonderful openings that you get in these retreats um and how how it's just part of everything how how that's incorporated into our life when we get get back to our everyday lives and is there one specific uh, thing you know a place in your life where you uh, it's really been important to have come here um, it's transformed your life yeah relationships i think it's really you know the truth is being lived more in relationships and that's been amazing so yeah it's just beautiful experience thank you thank you